You're watching EAC News. Thanks for joining us. A national movement has been set up to help clear mines in Cambodia to work towards achieving a mine-free country by 2025. This movement welcomes the participation of all people through charitable contributions to help mine officials achieve this work. EAC News reporter Anthony Ellis has the details. Prime Minister Hun Sen made a post on his official Facebook page announcing the bank account number where donations can be sent and participate in Cambodia's demining campaign. People can donate through the ABA Bank, Akleda Bank and Canada Bank. The Prime Minister wrote, This is a big national movement to reach zero landmines in 2025. I hope that our compatriots, both inside and outside the country, will continue to participate in the campaign to end the tragedy afflicting our poor land by 2025. On Sunday the 3rd of July, some deck Techchol project for the mine action was announced after Prime Minister Hun Sen ordered the Minister of Economy, Un Pon Monirut, to prepare a demining budget and expedite the demining process and encourage the private sector to join the Royal Government in achieving a mine-free Cambodia. To date, the funds raised for the destruction of landmines and exploded ordnance amount over $15.16 million dollars and 190 million 800,000 real, or equivalent to $47,550. During a meeting with the delegation of the ASEAN Para Games at the Peace Palace on Wednesday morning, Prime Minister Hun Sen ordered his assistants to release the official bank account information to receive donations for demining efforts in Cambodia. <laughs> Currently, Cambodia has more than 14,000 minefields left. Amounting to nearly 2,000 square kilometres of land that still needs to be cleared. A report from the Mine Authority states that from 1992 to May 2022, more than 2.4 billion square metres of the land had been screened for demining, clearing more than 1 million anti personal mines, and more than 260,000 anti tank mines, and more than 3 million explosive rendements of war. There have also been over 65,000 victims to the landmines and explosive rendements of war including 6,106 adult women, 1,393 girls of the total number of the victims, 19,818 were killed, 9,077 survived with disabilities and 36,108 were injured. Anthony Ellis, EAC News.